Hey everybody, so today's video is gonna be a book haul. Yes, I don't think anybody has ever seen me twerk that much before, but I totally forgot that I'm supposed to dance every time I do a book haul, and I have been forgetting, so now um, I'm gonna keep doing it, and it's gonna work me out, but we gotta do it because it's fun, and it adds something funny to these videos, and yeah, that's just how I am. But uh, yeah, so let's get on with this video. Okay, so I got four books from the library that I wanna show you guys. This is my July book haul, but this is not the only book haul that's gonna be in July. I have some books coming, so there'll be another book haul, but this is my July book haul. I only got four books. I know that's a small amount, but um, I can't get a bunch of books and then I won't read them all. They'll end up over there and they won't get touched. So I only got a few. But um, I also want to really want to talk about something really quick, two things really quick. Um, I've been getting asked why I only haul books from the library. Um, most of the time it's from the library. Um, it's because I do not like spending money on a book and then it ends up on my shelf and I never read it, or I read it and I don't like it and I waste money. So I'd rather go to the library and get a book there and get it for free and support my library. That's why I do it. And a lot of times it's because I'm broke as shit, okay? I may be an author, but a lot of times I'm broke as hell. But um, yeah, and then also, if you can tell that I got a new channel design, um, it's I love it so much. And then you can tell over here or over here, there's a little icon that's a person reading. I did all this, it took me forever. So let me guys, let, let me guys know. Let me know what you guys think about the new channel design. If you like it. I think it's very cute. It's more professional looking, but oh well, yeah. Okay, so the first book that I got today is De Deadly Little Secret by Laurie Ferrius Stolarz. Um, this is about a girl who gets involved with this guy who's been accused of, uh, he's responsible, not accused. Supposedly he's responsible for his ex-girlfriend's death and she gets involved with him against everybody else's judgment that she finds out there's something going on with him. So this sounds very interesting and it's short, so. I'm hopefully gonna get into this very, very soon. And then the next one I got is Unremembered by Jessica Brody. And this one is about a girl who wakes up, doesn't remember shit, and this guy shows up and is like, hey, I remember you, we were in love. But, uh, yeah, so I've heard this is really, really good, so I went ahead and I picked it up. So we're gonna see what happens with that. And then the next one I have is called The Darkest Minds by Alexandra Bracken, and I love this cover. I love the black and the, the metal looking effect and the, the orange font, it's really pretty. This is about a world where the teenagers and children have special powers because of some virus, and I've been hearing nonstop great things about this. Christine over at um, Poland Banana Books, I think that's her channel name, she loves this, so I had to check it out. And I got it, so hopefully you enjoy it it's a big ass book. And then the last one I have is The Fifth Wave by Rick Yancey. I've been hearing nonstop, sh just raving about this, just it, nobody will shut up about it, so I have to check it out, it's huge. But we'll see, and I have to get to it very quickly because it's on a waiting list, so I can't keep it forever. I only can keep it for three weeks. But hopefully I read it by then, and um, we'll see what happens with it. This has to do with aliens, I think. Yeah, so that's it. So I will see you guys next time with another video. Until then, go be awesome and comment, rate, and subscribe. Go check out some of these books if you haven't, or let me know if you've read any of them and they're good. And yeah, so see you guys next time. Bye.